Hey guys, welcome back or welcome to Petit Cavi. Not that long ago, I made a video about overweight guinea pigs and I was asked to do a video about underweight guinea pigs. If you think your guinea pig is underweight, after consulting your vet of course, and want some tips for increasing their numbers on the scale, then stay tuned to the video. Let's get right to the point. If your guinea pig looks like this, that means he's likely underweight. As you already know, you need to know the normal weight of your guinea pig and for this you need to weigh them regularly. Weekly weighings is something I suggest and more frequently if your guinea pig is not doing well. Here's a chart of the typical healthy weight of a healthy guinea pig by age. This chart is solely for the purpose of providing a reference to guide you. As mentioned in my overweight guinea pig video, weight varies mainly by age, gender, and breed. Other factors also play a role in the guinea pig's size and weight, such as their environment, diet, general health, and genetics. Since healthy weight varies among humans, it is the same with guinea pigs, so it's important to monitor and weigh your pets regularly to identify any potential problems. A guinea pig that has a great deal of weight loss in a short period of time usually has a health problem. I recommend contacting your vet immediately to rule out any underlying medical issues such as dental or digestive disease. If your pet is healthy but underweight, your vet will likely advise some changes in the diet and lifestyles. How to help them safely gain weight Adding alfalfa hay to their diet Guinea pigs are very fond of alfalfa hay Rich in calories and calcium, alfalfa hay is a staple in the diet for young growing guinea pigs under 6 months old and for pregnant or lactating females you can mix some alfalfa hay into their regular hay to encourage them to eat more. Timothy hay and orchard grass hay remain the most recommended hay for guinea pig feed. If your guinea pig needs to be on a low calcium diet, please confirm with your vet before adding the alfalfa hay. Adding whole uncooked oat to their diet. It is the ultimate food to help a lean guinea pig put on weight. Although guinea pigs are not green eaters, oats are not typically an appropriate part of their diet. However, some vets will recommend giving guinea pigs that show signs of weight loss very small amounts of oat, usually whole oats. A teaspoon per day mixed in the bowl of pellets is more than enough. Oats are high in carbohydrates and thus will aid in weight gain. Adding vitamin C as a supplement An extra dose of vitamin C helps boost the immune system and also stimulates and helps improve the appetite of guinea pigs. Choose vegetables that are high in vitamin C or give them extra vitamin C supplements. No need to worry about giving them too much vitamin C as excess vitamin C is excreted in the urine just like in humans. Feed them individually or hand feed separately. Take your underweight guinea pig out of the cage and feed them by hand.
When you feel they have eaten a big enough portion, you can return your fur ball to their brothers and sisters so they can socialize and eat again if they are still hungry. The purpose of taking them aside for feeding is to monitor the amount of food ingested and allow them to receive their portion, especially if they tend to be shy or slow eaters in a group of hungry little fur balls. Reward with treats. Providing your guinea pigs some treats every now and then is a great way to stimulate their appetite and keep them happy. This also helps strengthen the bond you have with your furry baby. Pea flakes are a crisp and tasty treat, perfect for adding some extra weight to your guinea pig. A favorite fruit is also a good option. Remember, treats should be given in moderation. It is important to remember that the staple diet of guinea pigs consists of unlimited hay, fresh and varied vegetables, especially those rich in vitamin C, and supplemented with quality pellets. If your guinea pig is looking a little thin, don't worry too quickly. This may be their normal weight. Small fluctuations in weight are normal. However, if your guinea pig loses more than 100 grams in a week, it is advisable to take them to the vet and for any other concerns as well. Remember, I'm not a vet, so please check with your vet before adding anything into their diet and making any adjustments. I hope you enjoyed the video, thank you for watching, and see you very soon for a new one. Bye!